a lot of things has gone wrong and I'm asked to keep quiet and not say a word except they are going to kill me. <laughs> but one more it is to die than what they have done to me on the internet. <laughs> that the world <laughs> feels I did something wrong. <laughs> I would rather prefer to die and tell my story <laughs> than die being quiet for nothing. <laughs> I was not arrested by any police officer. <laughs> No police officer handcuffed me and humiliated me. <laughs> it was the only person that sent his boys. I was invited to his house. <laughs> they called me on the phone and told me that he wanted to see me. <laughs> Stupidly for me because I had nothing at the back of my mind. I just took my shower, wore my gown <laughs> and went to his house. <laughs> to life you guys have posted the video so what is it party or to get your pity <laughs> i have fought for humanity i've fought for women i've fought for children i've fought for single mothers police that sent them to arrest me i told them fine then yeah, let's go to the station <laughs> they said if i don't keep quiet they were gonna shoot me down and kill me all I kept begging was, please, stop videoing me. <laughs> they said if I don't say what they asked me to say, that they are going to shoot me down. I had no choice. They videoed me and asked me to say everything. Asked me to say I impersonated Onyezi's house. I invaded his privacy. I came into his compound. They asked me to use my phone and do a live video. <laughs> I did a live video. They asked me to post it. I did. They asked me to roll on the ground and go and start begging on using his compound. By then he drove in. As soon as he drove into the compound, he popped me and <gasps> all I want is for the world to know that I did not drop into his house. <laughs> no police officer arrested me. I was never detained. I was just handcuffed. They did the video and posted it online. That is all I have to say. My blog. <laughs> but I wanted the world to know what happened before I leave. <laughs> before I take my own life. <laughs> I would die in my grave. I would I would never rest if I have to die without people knowing what happened to me. It's okay for you to judge, run your mouth and say things. It's your mouth. That's what it's meant for. <laughs>